What's up guys, in today's video, we're gonna be doing another catch and cook. The fish have finally decided to start biting. Luke is at the dam right now. I was originally gonna take an off day today, but I can't pass up this opportunity that the fish are biting at the dam. So, I'm at Walmart right now. As you can see, I'm going to pick up some stuff for a catching cook. From what I hear, Luke has been catching some crappie, some bluegill, and just like a mix of everything. He's fly fishing. I'm gonna pick up the little ultralight, try to get some big crappie. For the catching cook, we are gonna hop inside Walmart right now, pick up some of the ingredients we're gonna need for the catching cook, and then head on down to the dam. Today, it is stupid cold right now, and that's one of the reasons why I was gonna take an off day. I think it's like, let me, let me check. We're in North Carolina, guys. It says it feels like 15. The only time I wanna fish in 15 15 degree weather is if I'm ice fishing and I'm not ice fishing my hands are gonna be getting soaking wet It's gonna be brutal. It is a little windy too enough said Let's get to Walmart get the ingredients and go catch some fish every time I come to Walmart I somehow end up in this section right here I know I gotta go pick up the food But I gotta take a look at the fish and stuff because sometimes they do have really good deals going on Sometimes some of these are a dollar and they're like name brand zoom stuff for a dollar But I don't see any today, so we're gonna go get the stuff so that we can go fish this time Unlike other times I made a list so I'm not gonna forget anything this time first up we're going to get breadcrumbs and the problem is I'm never in the food section at Walmart so I don't know where anything is so this might take a little bit but I think I have an idea so we need oil breadcrumbs I already got the eggs I already got the pans we need a lighter and a few other things but after that we should be good here we go we finally found the breadcrumbs let's see do they have Italian style breadcrumbs those are my favorite where are they at oh right here there we go all right we got the first thing now we need to go find the oil and I need to double check the list because I already forgot. I had to have walked past this about like 30 times here. Here, let's just get the small one. That should be enough right there. I had the majority of this stuff at my house. We're not gonna spend money if we don't need to spend it. So we're only getting oil and breadcrumbs. Let's go check out and then head down to the river. I almost forgot the lighters. Thankfully, they're always at checkout. But we just made it down to the dam and it is really windy here. It is more windy than I thought. The waiters will warm me up a little bit. It's not too terribly cold, but that's right now. Got out of my warm car. We're about to throw these on. Hopefully, not freeze to death before we can catch a few fish and cook them up for you guys. Just like that. Got the waders on. Now we got about a quarter of a mile walk to the other side. <laughs> I gotta walk all the way around. This is how cold it is right now. Let me zoom in for you. Those are icicles. Oh wait, stop zooming in. They're icicles on the tree. But anyways, we're gonna get to fishing. Luke's catching shad, bluegill. Anything that is edible is going to be in this catch and cook. We just gotta catch some first. Oh, Luke's hooked up. There we go. I broke off. Is it a bluegill? Oh, he's a little small. First fish of the day. There we go. Little bluegill. Get them back. At least there's fish here. Now, if we can get one a little bit bigger than that, or a couple a little bit bigger Dude, than I mean, that, I that's that's a, a meal. Like that that's big. a meal. Dude. Got one. Nice. There we go. Oh, oh, I think I hooked a shad. Did you? I think it's fighting whatever it is. Yeah, this has to be a shad. I don't know. It probably is. Yeah, he's. Wait, it's still fighting, right? He's going in the current. Yeah. It's just yeah. At least we caught a fish today. There we go. Oh, it's oh a crappie! Gosh, it's a crappie! It's a crappie. <laughs> <laughs> grab him! Grab him! Hey! Dude, you there we hooked go. him like a shad. I hooked him like a shad. There we go! That's what I mean, first you never know. The day. You never know. Hey, first keeper size of the day. There we go. Little crappie. Him. Yeah, we're gonna bleed him. Make him taste nice Here, and fresh. What this fish did, this fish swiped at it and then it got hooked in the back. We are doing a catch and cook, boys. <laughs> we got the first fish of the day here not a bad one he's probably about maybe eight nine inches long not a bad one he should eat pretty good so what we're gonna do is we're gonna bleed him if you don't know how to bleed the fish you basically cut right here and then that cuts a big vein and they just bleed out and it makes the meat taste a thousand times better so that's what we're gonna be doing with all of our fish and it's cold so the meat's gonna taste better anyway so we're gonna do that and then get back to fishing got another one there we go this one. Oh, it's a big one. It's a big crappie. It's a big crappie. Oh, oh. Come here. Come here. Hold this, hold this, hold this. Oh, I thought he got off there. Man, he choked it. There we go. Look at how long this one is. This one's a long one. There we go. Not a bad one. Literally just hopping it off the bottom. Look at that. He choked that jig too. Look at that. Hard? Yeah, he smacked it. Literally just popping off the bottom. Now the fishing might be starting to turn on a little bit here. This is good. We're getting a catch and cook. Now if we can get about uh, two, one or two more of these, that should definitely be enough for a decent sized meal. Now this one, I think it may be a little bit bigger than the last one. Let's just compare them right here. A little bit bigger. Oh yeah, definitely bigger than the last one. 
Now this one might be about 10 inches. He's nine or 10. He's pretty close. Decent sized crappie, but we're gonna do the same thing that we did to this one right here. We're gonna bleed him, and then we're gonna try to catch a few more. Dude, I swear I think I just had another one. The Seriously? next cast. I literally think I just had another hit. This is crazy. The fishing's finally good. I haven't caught crappie like this like for two months now. This is awesome. I wanna take a trip. Oh! No! That was a really big one! No! Dang it! Oh, that might have been a shad. I got a scale on there. Uh -oh. Yeah, that was probably a shad, but that felt huge. That was a big one. Dang it. Got him. Got him. Ooh! Shad. It's a shad? Oh, I thought it was a really big crappie. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh, he ate it though. Man, I thought that thing was huge. I saw the length of it. I was like, oh my god. That thing's massive. But it's just a it's just a shad. Yeah, I know he ate it. Luke's not catching any fish, so he switched over to shad fishing. And he's got a big shad on right now. Look at that. Not a bad one. Just sucks can't eat them. They actually tasted good. We'd fill up so many coolers of them. There's a big shad run every year around March. And it is really early for them to be up here. It's because this river's been open for how long? I'm gonna keep trying to get at least one more crappie or bluegill or something. That's him. Fish, we got one. There we go. <laughs> oh my gosh. Snagged, didn't you? Yeah, I thought I was snagged. Dude, he's like not even fighting. They will. When he doesn't ride his hook. Where is he? Oh, oh there he is. Gosh, dude, that thing's huge. He ate it. Holy crap. He ate it. it. Oh, dude, this oh. thing's mom. Oh my god. Oh, dude. Grab him. Grab him. Grab him. Oh, oh, oh. Dude, look at that thing. Holy crap. Look at that. Show him. Dude. Holy crap! Oh my god! Look at that thing, dude. That thing's like 14 inches long. Bigger. No, than that's that. like 16. That's like 16. Holy crap! That's a monster. That's as big as the American shad. Look at that. Shed. Jeez. <laughs> On the ultralight, he didn't even put up a fight at all. Just came straight in. Let me know down in the comments if you guys would like to see a shad fishing video around March. Oh, I got one! I got one! What is it? What is it? What is it? Please don't be a shad. It's a crappie! It's a crappie! There we go. No, he's not. Look at him. Nice crappie here. He's a little bit smaller than the other ones, but he'll still keep. Look at that. Hooked right in the side of the mouth. Pop that right out. Another nice crappie. I think this is going to be the last fish of the day for us. And now I think we're going to go over there, start cooking them up because my hands are getting cold right now and as soon as we turn on that bur that burner i'm gonna warm them up and it's gonna feel great but we're gonna bleed this dude we got three crappie that, that's that's enough for a catch and cook there well, luke is going to start flaying the fish we got well luke accidentally cracked an egg so we got these fish right here well, luke's gonna start flaying them up i'm gonna go warm my hands in the car real quick and then i will be back when luke is done flaying the fish well, luke's almost done with the flays but we got a really big problem the lighters that i bought we left them outside and they are frozen, so I'm trying to warm it up. The flint will strike. Oh, it just lit there. I warmed it up. <laughs> hey, there we go. So we're gonna we're gonna light the burner now. Wait, pick it up. Yo, finally we got this thing lit. It took two minutes to light that thing. Now we're gonna put some oil in the. My pan. hands aren't working to get the freaking cap off, dude. Now put some oil in. Okay. Right there. There we go. We got our oil in. Man, dude, this is so cold my camera's not even working. Really? The autofocus isn't working. Jeez, come on. Show my guys. Show Look at the guys. guys. They still haven't they still haven't unthawed yet. All of them are like that. We're gonna lay a flay in here. No, we gotta dunk them in the eggs. What are you doing? Oh yeah, you oh, what am I doing? <laughs> Jeez, we gotta beat up the egg too. See, this is why you shouldn't have cracked the egg. Because why? look, it's frozen. <laughs> It is frozen. Yeah, but this one's gonna be frozen too. So, yeah, see, it is frozen. A little bit, but there we go. All right, so now we're gonna. Oh it my up. gosh, dude, the eggs. The doesn't matter. The eggs are frozen. The eggs are literally frozen. The eggs are frozen. It's taking. Oh my gosh, this. This might be yet another fail here. So he's dunking the flays in the eggs. And then there, you about to put it in. Just we should have did this in the parking lot next to the car. Should have done this in my house. First place are on. This is really turning into a disaster here. It's not working. We're gonna cook this by the trunk because it is so windy down here. It is so cold. My hands, they're not working. So we're gonna run up to the top 
And then, see, I need to turn that up. The the wind is literally blowing the heat out from under the pan. Oh my gosh, it is. So we're gonna head up there now. Here we go, part two. Turn up a little bit. That might get hot, so we'll have to like either use this. Yeah. All right, right, there we go. We finally got it lit now. We're out of the wind. We just decided to do it in the parking lot. There's pretty much no one here anyways. So we're just gonna keep, we're gonna wait till the oil starts to pop a little bit and then we're gonna finally start to cook these fish the right way. So what do you guys actually commented the So you take a little pinch of breadcrumbs and you put it in there. Oh yeah, this is And you see if it starts to, oh geez. This is one. If it starts to sizzle like that. So yes, we should be hot enough now to put the fish in. I think these are the same place as last. Yeah, you put it where there's no oil. Way to go. Now we can start cooking the fillets, finally. There. It's not really too hot yet, but it might get hotter. So. Holy crap, I'm starving too. There we go. All right. All right. We're gonna have to turn this down. It's already like you halfway. Do that every time. I don't know what a, the right setting is yet. So we're gonna let them cook for a little bit. We gotta flip the fillets now. Yeah, they're ready. Oh, dude, that looks so good. To flip. You gotta flip that one. I know, it's just hard with a pocket knife. There we go, flipping the flays. Oh! Now that one might be a little burnt. It's okay. There we go, we're still learning, we're still learning. Nah, dude, there that's we perfect. Go. There we go, perfect. Look at that. Man, next time we need to come down here with some bread, or some like, tortillas, make some fish tacos. Hey, there we go. They are ready now. Oh, there we go. Dude. We don't, we didn't really bring, <laughs> we literally need to get like a list going here. I'm just in the middle of taking off my waders. We're just gonna put them on this. Hopefully it doesn't melt through the bag. Which it is. It's melting. Watch out, watch out, watch out. It's melting the bag. There we go. We're gonna put the flays on there now. First ones are now done. Alright, here we go. We're gonna try a piece here. There we go. <gasps> I'm gonna try. Ah! Shoot! That's really hot. Look how hot that is. It's steaming. Dude, that is so good. It is so hot. Huh. Got fish right. in my car now. I'm gonna start. Alright, I'm not gonna have a piece just yet. I'm gonna try a piece. I haven't even tried a piece. Try it. Oh, yeah. That's good. There we go. That was actually really good. I haven't had fish in a while. Last time I had fish is when I was in Wisconsin. So, I actually forgot to film my outro out there. A little bit has changed since you see me last. Oh, I got a haircut. But, thanks so much for watching today's video. If you're new to the channel, don't forget to subscribe for a ton of amazing content coming your way and you're not gonna wanna miss it. Today we actually caught some fish, which is surprising. I'm so glad the fish are finally starting to bite at the dam. Hopefully it stays this way so we can get some more catching cooks for you. But thanks for watching. See ya.